If you're an aspiring electronics enthusiast, you might find yourself needing an oscilloscope to analyze your circuits. You do a quick search and you find that everyone recommends the ones that are often $400 and up. You say, screw that, I'm not sure I'm that invested in this hobby yet. So you, like me, stumble upon something like this. This right here is a generic DIY oscilloscope kit. They're sold all over eBay, and if you cash out like five more dollars, you'll get the clear acrylic case that you see I've put on mine. But don't be fooled. $20 for this is expensive. Do you want to know why? There's two fucking many through holes that you have to solder, so if you value your time, and you don't want to dick around debugging something like this, then maybe you should consider the $400 big boy toy. But if it's soldering practice that you're in need of, like me, this is the toy for you, because there is so much soldering to be done, it took me about 5-6 hours. But if you think after you order this and waited your two weeks for it to come from China that you can just get straight into soldering, you can't because the components are not clearly marked and so you have to measure a lot of them with your multimeter. And then you probably shouldn't do what I did, which was to place every component before I soldered them in. So the end result is that they don't look flush with the surface. But when you put the screen on, eh, who's gonna notice? So when you realize the fact that it's not working is probably your fault and you look into it and probably re-solder some of the connections that you made because you're a poor solderer and you probe that the voltage regulator is outputting the correct voltage and then you short JP4 which didn't even show up in the instructions it came in the fucking debugging flowchart you might have yourself an oscilloscope. Just kidding, the box you want to put it in that you bought is a fucking jigsaw puzzle and it just doesn't end. And so you might realize that only weak men read the instructions and so what I tried to do was build this without the instructions and then I couldn't and that pissed me off so I tried again and then you can see the slippery slope. I just fucking didn't want to look up the goddamn instructions. And this is all ass backwards, you build it top to bottom, it's fucking weird. So yeah, if, you, if you're getting, I don't know, I'm not angry at the fucking oscilloscope anymore, I'm angry at myself. Read the instructions and this will be fine. So if you can actually get through reading the instructions and get through the little learning lessons it'll throw at you, then you'll have yourself a little oscilloscope. But then again, it's only 200 kilohertz, so. I don't, fuck me, right?